Hello. It is a it is a new life. The um previous uh career ended rather poorly. Uh and unfortunately I wasn't recording at the at the time it happened. I just forgot to go live, I guess. And so anyway, I was uh in my uh, yak, and I was on my way back after taking out a couple of 109s, and I saw some, looked like 110s maybe, uh, hitting a ground target, friendly ground target, so I swooped down to fight them, see if I could scare them off, uh, put some shot af shots after one of them, flew past him, and then just blew up. Uh, to this moment, I'm still not sure what happened. Best guess is I collided with something that I never saw coming and, uh, so yeah, it ended pretty suddenly, pretty, uh, unfortunately, but, uh, you know, probably painless and, and now we're moving on. So starting a new one, I'm going to, um, to Moscow and I'm going to try to find something that'll let me fly the hurricane. Okay. How do I... Okay, so we're going to filter down to only squadrons that fly the Hurricane. And we'll start as early as possible. Uh, looks like there's basically one at this point in time. Oh. It's kind of far back from the front. That's my only complaint with that, but... Whatever, we'll... Uh, Maybe use it anyway. I'm looking what uh, options do I have here? Any that are more forward? And it seems like they just kind of... They kind of don't do hurricanes except sort of... Uh, sort of early. Or sort of far back from the front. So that's alright. 736 Air Defense Fighter Air Regiment. So I guess we'll be Russian. That is right near Moscow, though, so I guess that's kind of cool. If we're sort of fighting defensively. I've never done a Moscow career, so I don't really know how this goes. That's fine. Yaroslav Belov. I love it. I, uh, I know a guy whose last name is that, but he's uh, probably not quite that old. This is all fine. By appointment is great. And Iron Man. That's really the kicker here. But I like to do it. Keeps the stakes high. Forces me not to just do stupid things and to try and take my life seriously. Which is all. quite the cutscene and really loud really really loud okay junior lieutenant yeah, that was the sad thing in the last one I had just been promoted and now and we're back to the back to the beginning so this is me haven't really done anything but you know what I'm alive so let's check out the unit always like to see who the other new guys are who else is new around here? Oh, really? Nobody. I'm kind of the newest we've got. Looks like this guy, Aristark. Ar Aristark? Aristark? Kabanov? He's, uh... He's probably the uh, youngest we've got. Oh, it's a white hurricane. Nice. Alright, ten of them. Twelve pilots. I mean, that's fine. That's fine. That works. Okay, there's nothing going on usually first day. We just kind of find our way around. So let's go ahead and move on here. I do, I think, want to adjust some of the like uh, parameters and settings. And also I should get an idea. What is this? March? No, December? 
That's got to be a December 3rd. Okay, I see. Heavy weather. That's interesting. Clouds 900. Very cold. All right. All right. Enemy planes spotted crossing the front line, which is unfortunately not that close. That was kind of the nice thing about the uh, uh, previous career I was doing. My airfield was right on the front line, so when something came up, I was there in, you know, minutes. That was kind of cool. All right, here's where I can do some options. Realistic. I do like to start on the runway. We'll go moderate. I was doing okay in moderate. And we'll do medium. Density of front line. I think that has to do with what you see on the ground more than what's going on in the air. Could be wrong about that, but I think that's right. So it governs like, uh, you know, the tracer fire. You'll see uh, back and forth on the ground and that sort of thing. All right. This all looks pretty great. Again, is December the 3rd, 1941. Early. Okay, and uh, my mission, oh, I'm on two missions today already. That's actually kind of surprising considering how many of us there are, but we got to intercept bombers and escort bombers. I do not enjoy the escort missions. I wonder how deep that is. Pretty deep, so. All right, well, we'll just get into this and see... Uh, what time it gets to be by the end of the first mission because I don't have a whole whole ton of time. See if they let me, they do not, they kind of lock out most of the options here, which I got to say, I kind of understand. I really care about having a mirror. Don't know much about fuel, but I think I'll cut it back a bit. Otherwise, I may just kind of leave this as is. So I've got, what, probably eight? Or 12. It's got to be 12. Or additional. So yeah, I think that's total 12. And that should be good. They could start me with, so I don't think I'll argue with them. All right. Let's go. It probably stands to be said. I don't know the hurricane that well. So it may take me a few missions to try and sort of optimize. Ooh, gritty. I do like how easily you can kind of see, though. I do appreciate that. I have just the one shutter. No uh, fuel mixture, interestingly.
not a problem, just interesting. It is cloudy today, isn't it? Might be the most weather I've ever seen in a career mission. It is not snowing, but it is heavy, heavy weather. And we probably ought to be flying like a right echelon here. Number two spot should be mine. That doesn't mean it will be. Not by any stretch of the imagination. It looks like there's a gap there, so let's see if I can get to it. He's going fast. I don't know what he's doing? I sure don't feel like my bird's got that kind of speed. Gotta try and match him and hope he doesn't do anything sudden. I wonder if the other one backed off and maybe is giving me a little more room. Nope. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna swing way out because I'm just asking for a collision. They are not respecting my number two spot here, so I'm just not gonna risk it. my trim, my elevator trim right there. I'm trimmed to climb right now and I need to not climb. I gotta find a nice flat spot for the trim here. Alright, we're falling in line. Temps are okay. Target was spotted in a new location. Check your flight map. Ah, okay. That's different. They're right off the bat here going for a ground attack mission. That's, uh, bold. I gotta say too, it didn't take all that long to get out here, so maybe the map is smaller than it than it looks, or I was zoomed in on it or something, because that didn't take too long to get out here to the front line. I gotta look for him. Hmm. Somebody spotted him, I think, but I don't see him yet. Looking. Are they low or high? I'm gonna just follow here until I until I also acquire a visibility. this way. I still don't see anything. I don't know, am I stork? I was stork before. 
seems like we're kind of spreading out. But I don't see anything yet. Oh. Get under the cloud and... Is that a 109? Yes, it is. Okay. Oh. Alright. This got real hot real fast. We got... Fighters. A pretty hefty ground strike group. Uh-oh. Uh, engine is stuttering a bit there. Shot up a bit here. Try and get out. Bunch of them either drop bombs or they're heading home or I'm not sure what exactly. Mm. The fighter on me. I've gotten low. What I've got to remember is our focus is the strike package. Try to watch my 6 too, though. Yeah. Oh, I see the tracers. fast. He's very fast. <laughs> the long deflection shot there. A lot of guys gunning for me. I'm kind of hoping to get a deflection shot into the cockpit here. Yeah, he's stubborn. Or an engine fire, maybe? There, his engine stopped. Alright. Now I have been... I have been hit. I need to be mindful of that. But I also don't want to just give up on my boys. Come back a bit. Trying to help my boy there, but he gonna drag me down for nothing. Now he's long gone. Not 
really sure how ammo supply is on this. This thing turns on a dime. I'm already uh, out on most of my guns. Got ammo. Alright. Let's see if we can get home. Let's see if I can find home. deck here. I hope nobody's following me. This is not a quick plane. Uh-oh. Evasive maneuvers. I'm out of ammo, so this becomes a little bit awkward. Turning to follow me. I mean, it seems like he's leaving. It's interesting. I I feel like I almost have to keep my nose pointed down a little bit to stay flat. Like this thing generates so much lift that it's. Got a point down to stay at an even altitude. I'm keeping on the tree line here. Last thing I need is a wreck. I have been shot up a little bit. That was a pretty good little battle. The tail gunners on the uh, I don't know what what we were even attacking. One tens probably. Good here. I can actually throttle up a little. I probably should. Not the greatest rearward visibility, I'll say that. But we're moving. I was buffeting a little there. Not sure what that was. There it goes again. A little bit of turbulence, maybe. Alright, I'm not far from the airfield, and it doesn't really seem like anything is following me. Not that I can see. need to find the airfield and put down and hope some of my guys are look at that a hole in the canopy it was from the uh, tail gunner about got me good on him too I think I turned away a couple of them though we broke up their bomber group spare us a little bit of damage anyway. Gotta learn the location of this airfield. Always tricky in the snow. There, I see it. How will fare? Oh, that must be Moscow. Big city. Got 
want any. Seems a lot bigger than Stalingrad. But... Alrighty. See if I can get a flare, show me which way is downwind. in on a sort of southeastern heading then. So what I will do I'm just gonna check if I'm being followed at all. Hopefully not. I will just sort of enter an orbit here. Now this is in miles per hour. I don't recall the landing speed. but I'm sure that it's slow. Let's get down a little bit. And then get ready to bring this on in. is pretty obnoxious. There we go. Wonder if there's a flap indicator anywhere. I can just barely hear the flaps. slow floater, that's for sure. You land that on an aircraft carrier. Alright, one mission down. We survived it. It was an exciting one. Got a couple bullet holes in the upper portion of my rudder there. One light plane, it says. I put some rounds into some bigger ones, but I don't think they went down. They just they'll turn around and head for home. Which, I mean, is honestly most of the objective, so. Mission accomplished, though. That's something. Let's see how the boys made out. <laughs> the, the one guy who was sort of close to me killed in action. Well, I didn't know him well. Seemed like a decent fella. You win some, you lose some. Rest in peace, my guy. Wonder where he went down. I think I can. Uh, I'm not sure I can see that anymore, actually. Try to let me pull up. Huh. Does let me pull up a little bit. That's kind of cool. I didn't know I could do that. Hmm. Next. Looking at the time, I do not think I have time for for that mission. Uh, wasn't it really expecting to get a double mission in a single day? Normally that. Uh, doesn't happen, but particularly with this being a bomber escort, that's going to be a long. You know, those are usually 40 minutes at least, so I think we'll have to split this day up, which is a little unfortunate, but uh, 
that's just the way it looks like it's going to be, so. All right. Off to a decent start, an exciting start, but a decent one. So uh, until next time, we will catch you later.